What's up, everybody? Crazy Mike D back again, and today is a spicy review. And this review has been uh, long overdue. Um, this come, this uh, review comes uh, brought to you by Insane Hot Sauces. Uh, my good friend Philip Sane sent me uh, a while ago. Quite a while ago, like I said, it's way overdue. Um, he sent me some hot sauces. Um, and he also sent me three lollipops. He sent me the, uh, oh, or was it just two? I know he just sent me a Trinidad Scorpion one. And I, I think he just sent me two, but this, I did the, do this, the Trinidad Scorpion lollipop, cherry bomb lollipop. And this is the Reaper cherry bomb lollipop. Now oh, that is a big lollipop. That's it's <laughs> thick. It's not like those little thin suckers that you get from the grocery store in candy aisle. This is a big, big lollipop. Um, like I said, uh, Philip, Mister Sane, I uh, really apologize for the late review. I got really swamped with different products. I like, I'll show you a little. These are all, those are all my hot sauces. And all the products that I have. There. Well, that's, I just got really, really swamped. But I mean, to do different reviews for hot sauces, hot products. Like, I'm really, really swamped with stuff. I have a, uh, the Reaper challenge to do. I have something really special planned out for that, so definitely keep watch of it. Um, a friend of mine, Drew Kutra, Kutra, not always, not always sure how you spell your name, Drew, but got some pickles that I got to review. <sighs> so far behind my stuff, but I'm trying to catch up. Um, so I decided to do the uh, cherry lollipop tonight. Just did some hot sauce. A hot sauce review for my good friend Stuart Roy. Um, probably gonna be uploading this one first, and then the hot sauce next, right afterwards. Awesome hot sauce. So we're gonna try to open this. Oh boy. Um, as you can see, there's a little, little bit of damage to the, the label. What happened there was when you sent me the other sauces, one of the sauces broke. Um, probably because the uh, postal workers were just careless because the box was dented. It did look like it was either dropped or kicked or God knows what. Um, because he did package the... Uh, the hot sauces and bubble wrap and packing peanuts. So it should have been safe. No. I'm trying to get this thing open, but it's been a bugger. All because some idiot at the post office wanted to cheat my package like shit. And yeah. I really don't like the post office. I really don't, guys. They, uh, they scare me. Because I don't know if, like, if I'm going to get a product from a company or friends going to be sending me a product. I don't know if that if I'm going to get it without it being broken. Dang it. It doesn't seem to want to open here. Just give me one second. I apologize, guys. I should have had my knife with me. I have it now. I'm gonna try to cut this open. Cause this has been a, a real bugger trying to open this. And it is, it's because um when I got this package, the hot sauce had spilt all over this and uh, created quite a mess. I, uh, I uploaded the picture of the package and everything, 
And people were saying, well, why didn't he package it well enough? Why didn't he put, put in bubble wrap or, or packing peanuts? Well, he did. But the postal services, they don't care. You can write fragile all over the damn box and they'll still treat your package like shit. <sighs> Yeah, trying to get this off as a bugger because of that. I even had trouble with the, the Trinidad Scorpion one. Oh, yes, he did send me a third one. It was the uh, the Ghost Pepper. That was the first one I tried. That's right, that's right. And I did try the, uh, the Trinidad Scorpion one. That was the last one I tried. That one was wickedly hot. I know this one's going to be hot, too. Sticky as hell. My hands are just completely sticky. I'm going to have to wash them. But there you go. You can see the uh, little bits of, I'm guessing, reaper powder that he put in there. Or uh, dried peppers, maybe. That side's not bad, but look at that side. Holy crap. That's a lot of pepper powder. Ground up peppers. Be happy to know that these are sugar free for those who are diabetic and have to watch their sugar intake. These are completely sugar free, so these are awesome for you. If you have, want a sweet treat, grab yourself one of these, especially if you're a chili head. Awesome. So, I'm gonna see how long I can have this in my mouth. Uh, probably not gonna be that long because the Trinidad Scorpion one was really hot and I didn't have it in my mouth that long. So we're going to give this a go, and uh, after I can't take it anymore, I'm going to review it, give a flavor rating, and give a, a heat rating. Here we go. Hmm. Very sweet. Oh, it Hmm. Mm hmm. Very sweet. Oh. Hot. Hmm. The juice is that's why it's making my me salivate really, really bad. With Bit is just on fire. It's going down the throat and it feels like I'm swallowing liquid fire or lava. Mmm. 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 Flavor wise, that is awesome. Mmm. I'm done. Holy shit, guys. Holy. Crap! I can not take it. Wow! Ah. That is so hot. First it was, it was nice and sweet. Just for a few seconds there. And then the heat. Whammo. Holy fuck. You remember back, I did a review for Vertigo Hot Candy, Hot World's Hottest Candy. This blows it right out of the freaking window. Right out of the water, I mean. Right out of the window. That blows it right out of the water. Oh. Why? Why is something so hot? Yeah, that'd be a fucking idiot to enjoy something like that. Holy shit, that's hot. Flavor wise. Oh, that was good. Very sweet. I love that cherry flavor. Then you get the, the flavor of the Reaper. Very sweet pepper. Oh, wow. It's like you used. He, he looks like he used fresh uh, Carolina Reapers. 
heat on it. It's fucking insane, man. That's a 10 for heat. Hottest freaking candy I've ever had. Way harder than the vertical candy. Way, way harder than the vertical, ca vertical candy. Oh. I don't want to lick my fingers because it's all over my fingers. Holy shit, Philip. Now, they meant no insult about saying you don't have to be an idiot to enjoy something like that. What I meant was that you had to be crazy. Your tolerance has got to be through the roof to enjoy something like that. It's hard to freaking talk. Holy shit. I'm gonna put the link to it say hot sauce in the link description. Also the link to uh Phillips. <coughs> oh excuse me. Oh Phillips uh Web or a page, Facebook page for his company. Both will be in the description below. I gotta go get some milk, guys. This is burning like crazy. So I'll see you later. If you like this video, hit the like button, comment, subscribe, share. Like always, this is Kizzy Mike D signing off. Mr. Sane, awesome, awesome product. Really appreciate it. Thank you very much for sending me this to review. That's insane. <laughs> that is insane. So definitely check out his link in the description. See if you can get yourself some of these awesome, awesome things, man. Awesome lollipops. I gotta get some milk. I'll catch you guys later. Mike D's, crazy Mike D's honey off. See you later, guys.